This is a pretty big town. It's not like this is the only These clear. young women no. look or, like available. they're getting ready for any typical day. So, but say, with scripts in hand, they are preparing Pause. for the first day of shooting on a new short film yeah. by MSUM film student Joe okay, Greening. Think, like that won't be too grainy. This is a prequel to a, mo a movie that I actually made freshman year for a class. We have more resources, we have more people, so this is a chance to make like a cool story behind the little like two minute video that I made for freshman year. You're not much for talking. Greening has many talented people working both on screen and off, including fellow MSU Moorhead student, Marissa Iverzu. I think it's great. I know Joe's really passionate about film. Yep. Scene one, take three. Greening's passion for filmmaking is nothing new. I mean, I've known that I wanted to do something with film since I was like in second grade. Uh, I used my family's video camera and me and my friends, uh, we'd make movies in my backyard and in my basement. We'd, re we'd make like three of them in one day, just like little 10 minute movies on the VCR recorder. And then with the backpack, you're going to slide down. But the quality of his short there. films has evolved right yeah. from using his parents' video camera to now having his own high quality equipment as well as a full cast and crew. Take, take another drink of that water. That was cool when you did that. Even when he's not working on a project for a class, Greening still sees the importance of self improvement. If you're always practicing, then you're always going to be getting better. And Saunter faster. <laughs> With his experiences in well, and out yeah. of the classroom, Greening has high hopes that a feature film will uh, soon in be in his future. Bat, or if we do everything handheld. Michael Downs, Campus News.